It just seems like sometimes the word doctrine scares people. It sends shivers up and down their spines. And uh, they are reminded of the Inquisition and of hard-bitten theologians that are scrabbling furiously over uh, words that don't make any difference. It might have been important once, you know, but doctrine's not that important anymore. Probably some of the problem is we haven't done a real good job of, of teaching doctrine so that people understand it. And they're certainly not arguing that we ought to be delivering our theology notes on Sunday morning services. But this de-emphasis on doctrine, I think, goes a lot with the postmodern culture in which we're living in right now that de-emphasizes doctrine, de-emphasizes theology, and emphasizes a personal narrative and our common experience. Sometimes in my uh, Theology One class, I ask the class, what are the dangers if uh, doctrine doesn't take its rightful place in the churches? And they come up with a pretty good list, usually, of some isms, such as emotionalism, and liberalism, and authoritarianism, and maybe legalism. And I think they're right, and they, what they're saying represents very much what we believe here at uh, Shepherd's Theological Seminary. We believe that doctrine is important, that truth is important, that theology is important. Truth is the very center of a Christian's life. It's the very focus of what a church is all about. And we're certainly committed to a proper emphasis upon the doctrine of God's Word.